I'm Mercedes Steele. I'm a money mentor, and I'm taking over the Next Gen Vest Snapchat today. I'm an incoming freshman at Utica College. I'm majoring in psychology. I'm in the honors program, and I'm minoring in criminal justice. Guys, I apologize for not being on campus today, but I'm going to give you a lot of great information about Utica College. Just text me in any questions that you want, and I'll answer them as soon as I can. With the honors program, you have to keep a 3.2 GPA, and there are a couple perks that are really, really great, and I'm going to let you know in the next snap. With the honors program, there are special classes with limited enrollment, and you're able to apply to classes earlier than the other students. As well as classes, there are unique opportunities for students to research with faculty members, and this is a plus because it looks amazing on your resume for grad school or even uh, future careers. So each semester for the honors program, you have to take two honors classes. So this semester, I'm going to be taking honors psychology as well as honors written communications. So on campus, there's always something happening all the time. So I'm going to let you guys know about a couple of events that are really interesting. So one of the events that happens on campus is called Midnight Breakfast, And the Greeks serve all the students free breakfast to help these stress right before finals. Another event that happens on campus in October is called Homecoming, where parents, family, friends come, even alumni, and they just chill out. There's fun events. It's really cool. Take Back Your Prom is an event that was created by the LGBT community, and anyone can go to it. It's basically for people who haven't went to prom, so you can dress however you want and bring whoever you want. Squirrel Day is a dedication to the Sparky the Squirrel who passed away because he got into one of the engines and created a blackout at school. So at Squirrel Day, the dean of the school actually gives a eulogy for Sparky the Squirrel, and then they have a whole dedication where all these fun events happen, and there's like a lot of food and stuff. So right by the campus, there's a bowling alley, and every Tuesday, each game's only $2, and you can just go hang out with your friends and de-stress. It's really cool. So I just want you guys to know that at Utica, there's an amazing support system. Everyone's so nice, and it's just like a big family away from home, so it's really awesome. Utica, they want to help you with anything you need. It could be tutoring, it could be changing your classes, it can be homesickness, it could even be an emergency to get home as soon as possible. On campus, there's four ways of transportation. There's Amtrak, there's a bus company, there's a car rental service called Zipcar, and Uber. So on campus, they have a bus company called Bruno Bus Company. It's only $75 for a round trip to take you to Manhattan, back to Utica, or vice versa. So Zipcar is a car rental service where students can borrow their car for a couple of hours. The only thing is they do need to pay for it, and they need their license for a particular amount of time. On campus, they have Amtrak, and it could take you straight to Penn Station to go back to the city, or it could take you any other place you need to go. So I'm going to give you guys some tips for incoming freshmen. I have heard these tips from upperclassmen at Utica, and I'm going to pass them along the information to you guys. At college, if you're going upstate or anywhere cold, make sure that if there is some sort of fire drill in the nighttime, to always keep warm clothing right by your bed. So my upperclassmen friends gave me the advice of being careful with my money. Because if you spend too much, you may need that money for something more important like food, supplies. If you want to get textbooks from your college, you could, but it may be a little pricey. So you guys do want to save money, so you may want to get it from Amazon or Chegg or even a library. The amazing thing about NextGenVest is that we can help you make a budget to make sure you spend enough money on things that you do need and then have personal expenses for yourself as well. I know you're probably thinking, is it hard to make friends at college? If you keep an open door policy and open mind, I think you'll make friends really quickly. So I know everyone's excited to go to college, but make sure you spend some time with your family and especially your pets before you go because you will miss them. Hey guys, it's an end of my snaps today. I hope to do it again soon. But if you guys need any more help with anything, text in to NextGenVest. We'll be glad to help you.